Hello everyone, welcome back to another Adobe Premiere Pro CC 2021 tutorial. In this one I'm going to show you how to adjust your audio or your voice to make it sound better. And we're going to do the very quick fixes. So this isn't an in-depth tutorial, but we can make some real quick changes to make your voice sound much, much better. All right, first step here, I'll show you. I've got some footage here and I'll hit space bar so you can hear what I'm working with. Hello everybody, welcome back to another Adobe Photoshop CC 2021 tutorial. All right, this is one of my tutorial videos, and I'm just doing that as I always do. The first step, if you're following along, is you want to go change your workspace from the editing workspace to the audio workspace. When you do that, you're going to see a whole bunch of stuff. But what we want to work with is in the essential sound side of things. What you can do here, and again, these are, these are preferences that work for me, but work works for me may be different for you. The first thing I will show you is the preset options. There are a whole bunch of them, but if you're a male like I am, you would probably want to try the balanced male voice. This is the one that works best for me, and you can also see here that it is auto-matched to target loudness of 23 LUFS, which is a broadcast standard, so it's matching to broadcast standards. You'll also see here that I have repair and clarity clicked. Now, they are clicked on, and it's automatically set the dynamics to 4.5 so this is the dynamic range of a recording and this is automatically selected let's hear what it sounds like now hello everybody welcome back to another adobe photoshop cc 2021 tutorial very similar but there's been a slight change what i like about dynamics is you can adjust this on the fly now watch this hello everybody welcome back to another adobe photoshop cc 2021 tutorial so the dynamics is a very important slider here so if you're too quiet or you're too high or you're too loud, you can adjust the dynamics and you can reanalyze it as you go. Now, you'll also notice here that I have the EQ set and I have selected subtle boost male. So that means I just want a little bit of a boost to my voice, but this might not be the one for you. You may want to also try the background voice. Um, there's some effects in there. Let's go ahead and listen to this one. Hello everybody, welcome back to another Adobe Photoshop. That sounded pretty good. Now listen to the subtle boost male. We'll go back to the beginning. Hello everybody, welcome back to another Adobe Photoshop. It's a little bit higher pitched, but it is a little bit louder as well. And you can also see the waveform here, so it's increasing it a little bit. Also, you can enhance speech. I've selected enhanced speech, and I've selected low tone. I have a low voice, and I want my voice to sound even lower and a little bit more bassy. So I've gone ahead and done that. And the last thing that you will notice here is there are clip volumes as well. So if you want to adjust how much uh, volume or how loud yours is. So if you want to increase it, the loudness, for example, you can increase it very slowly, but you can jack it up here instead of having to do the standard right click and then going in and doing it that way. Guys, play with these settings. I like, again, balanced male voice for me. I like the uh, dynamics. I set the dynamics to about 4.5. I've also got a subtle boost male, but you may also like a few of these other ones. And uh, I'll send. I'll have another couple of videos coming up here of some uh, some cool audio effects. So anyway, stay tuned. Thanks for watching. Be back soon.